welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Monique Miner. I am a licensed cosmetologist who focuses on hair removal. Today, we are going to do some facial waxing. We are gonna wax our lip, chin, and our brows today for you using Tress Wellness Wax. This is a great wax kit that you can use from home. It is available on Amazon and I will have the link below. Today, I wanna to test it out though. Is it sensitive enough to use on your face and does it pick up the fine facial hair that we have? I love that this is available on Amazon and that you can use it for home. I do have other videos of waxing other parts of my body, so I definitely do recommend this wax. And I don't know if you guys are like me, <laughs> but I'm pushing 40 years old and I get little hairs that pop up around my chin area and you may not always be able to make it into the wax studio to get waxed because you can wake up one morning and there's one here, the next morning, another one. And I don't love tweezing because tweezing, you can actually break the hair if your tweezers are pretty sharp or if you just pull it the wrong way. So I like to just get up and turn my wax spot on and remove that hair. I'm gonna start off by using our pre-spray on our skin. So I'm gonna go ahead and spray this here. It's our pre-wax spray. And I'm gonna go ahead and just cleanse my lip and my chin where I'm going to wax. And this not only cleanses the area, but it's also gonna put a barrier between your skin and the wax to protect your skin. You just need a little. You don't want it to be too wet, otherwise the wax would not adhere. Okay. So first you definitely wanna make sure your wax is at the right temperature for waxing your face. You can always test it by using right here. You want to get a good amount on your wax stick and we're going to start with the lip. The lip is the most sensitive part. So I like to just get that part over with. We're going to do a thin strip because again our facial hair is pretty thin so you don't need a thick strip. The thinner the strip the better that it'll pick up the, the hair. This sets very quickly. So you're gonna go ahead and hold your skin taut. Grab it and remove. It got them. And it's almost painless. Like it gives you a little sting, but it doesn't last long. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and do the other side. Try to make a little lip there. Okay, should be ready. Hold your skin taut. Ooh, I can hear that one. Did you guys hear that? Now I also like to check my corners. I got it. No hair left there. Next, we are gonna tackle these little 30 to 40 year old <laughs> hairs that like to pop up. <laughs> like, why does that happen? <laughs> now, right now, mine are fine. You can end up with thicker hair that ends up growing. So there's two different types of strips you're gonna use. Right now, this is just gonna be a nice thin strip in my targeted area. But if the hair is a little bit more coarse, I'd go ahead and make it a little thicker and just do this to it to really work the wax in that coarse hair. And with coarse hair, you are going to remove the wax a little faster than you do with fine hair. With fine hair, you wanna do a nice relaxing pull. Go ahead and hold the skin taut. I got you. <laughs> Let's just make sure. Okay, I could go back a little more right there. So we'll do another strip there. Let's check over here. Can you guys see that piece of hair? 
I hope the camera is catching that because I can see it in the camera. That is. <laughs> Anyone else understand what I'm going through? My struggle? <laughs> I am applying pressure. Let's clean that up. Don't want to make a mess. Okay, let's see if we get that little sucker. I don't feel it. I don't know if you guys can see. No. Oh wait, there we go. You see the little hair? So again, I definitely recommend all of this, the little white specks that you see, that's hair. And that's hair that's coming from the root. I definitely recommend the Trust Wellness Wax to use at home. You can use this anywhere on your body and I'm showing today that it is sensitive enough okay I got that one with that strip it is sensitive enough to use on your skin you see there's not a lot of redness in my skin my skin is not irritated what I will say if you are waxing your skin for the very first time make sure that you are prepping your skin with the before spray like we showed at the beginning and I would not wax my skin for the very first time if I have an event to go to or if I'm going to be out in the sun all day because your skin will be a little sensitive and you can get a little irritation. You might break out a little bit because your skin doesn't know what's going on. So I might just get a little irritated. But as you continue to do it, my skin doesn't get irritated at all and I've been waxing my face for years. I told you guys I'm going on 40. <laughs> All right, let's get to these brows. So I'm gonna go ahead and use the pre-wax spray on my brows. You guys see the hair there? Go ahead and cleanse the top and the bottom.
Now, once you're done, you wanna go ahead and spray the after spray on a cotton. This is gonna help soothe the skin, protect it from ingrowns. So we wax underneath the chin, lip. And I got some, guys, this stuff smells so good. It smells like coconut. I love coconut. And that's how you do it. <laughs> See the brows? <laughs> I'm just going to kind of rub in the spray so I'm not look too shiny. But again, you guys, this is available on Amazon. I recommend this. Coming from a professional, I recommend you using this at home because it's very sensitive to your skin. You do wanna make sure that you have the wax at the right temperature and that you are applying it correctly on your skin so you do not damage your skin. You can go ahead and take a look at some of my other videos. I do have one on temperature and I do have a few on what the wax should look like when it is cooled down and ready and on other body parts. So make sure you take a look at those videos and click the link down below to purchase your kit today. You can also go on or download their app wax pal app and there's more tips on here and you can purchase your wax on here as well here's my pod happy waxing from home i hope that this helped you make sure you guys follow trust wellness wax as well as myself on instagram tiktok and here on youtube at monique minor skin hope you guys enjoyed this video hopefully i gave you some helpful tips and I didn't really do tricks, but I <laughs> hope I gave you some helpful tips. If you have any questions, make sure you put that down below as well. And I'll see you guys in the next video.